after you've tromped through, you know, the ice and the sand and the dirt and the slush, well, enter the clean machine AstroTurf. And this is not one man, number one, you're getting two. First of all, 169 reviews at hsn.com. 113 of them are perfect five star reviews. Well, today, awesome buy. I know we don't have a lot of time, but I, we do these normally for $39.95. For two of them, you're getting two for $27.95. And choice of jute to evergreen, black cherry, flint, or black forest, which is new. Yeah, exactly, black forest. Black forest is kind of a nice combination of the uh, the jute and the... Yeah, it uh, really is. The it is the most limited, too. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, the two of them. It's kind of a black and brown, which I really like. Mm -hmm. But let's show everyone. I mean, I love, Bobby, what we, when we talk about these mats, and you were saying we don't have a lot of time. I want you to see this. This is a mat that's going to do exactly what a mat was designed to do and what you want your mat to do. Keep the dirt and debris outside in the mat so it doesn't go inside the house. So you're not vacuuming a ton. You're not going to be sweeping Definitely. every single day. So I've got some sand and dirt. This could be, it could be the sand from the roads that we're going to start seeing in the winter time. But on this boot, <laughs> and what I'm going to do is just wipe my feet on this mat. So that's what we're doing. We're going to wipe your feet on the mat, and it clears all that dirt off of the boot. So you say, well, that, okay, can, can any old mat do that? But what I want to show you is that that might not have been the first time we wiped our feet. That could have been a week or three weeks wow. or four weeks Holy or months cow. of dirt and debris that settles into this mat that's that amazing. we trap inside that mat, and it still does the job to clear that boot, that shoe, the paw prints of the pets. So it is an amazing mat. And it's because of this AstroTurf that it does such a great job at scraping the bottom of your shoe, but then it traps all that dirt in the mat so it doesn't get in the house. It will hold great? up to five pounds, Peter? Five pounds. Five yeah, pounds. we've actually got, we've got this, uh, mm. we've got five pounds over there on our little scale right there. Okay. And then I've got another one in here. Mm -hmm. This looks like more than five pounds. Mm -hmm. So you'll see as I start to just shake that dirt in there, it almost disappears right exactly. down into the fibers. And that's really, that's the magic. It looks like a magic trick, but it's really not. It's just that sand going down in between the fibers of that AstroTurf, and that's what allows it. So if the dirt's going down, then it allows that AstroTurf, you can hear it, those yeah. fingers to do the job So it's not sitting on top over. of the rug, exactly. so when the next person steps on it, it's yeah, actually you know large, large I'll down I'll show you just it. on these other mats. So I'll, I'll sprinkle okay. a little dirt on those. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. And you see these three different types of popular mats. But look what happens with that dirt as I sprinkle it on there. So sprinkling the dirt on the uh, AstroTurf mat is completely different because it does go down into the mat. Well, it's windy out here. Yeah, it's see really it? windy. Oh, my and you sand know what, everywhere Peter, and chilly. I, <laughs> look at that. Yes. I love the size of these two. These are really ample, right? A 36 by 20. If you look at the comparison. Right, they're a lot next bigger. Next to the, the other mat that we have over here. I mean, these are a larger mat. Um, and the other cool thing about these, it, 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 first of all, Peter's going and going and going still. That was five pounds of sand. And even visually, if you look at it, you really can barely see. It. Exactly. That's the magic that it goes down in there and it traps all that sand and dirt so it doesn't. Imagine what five pounds of sand drawn into your house oh on your hardwood gosh. floors, your tile floors, into yes. the kitchen or the living room. That's the difference. You want a mat to be like that last line of defense to keep all that dirt out. And right. now we're going into here's another great thing about this because obviously we're going to go into the wet season. We're going to have a lot of snow and ice and, and then even when it melts, this is going to be perfect in that weather as well because it's going to be able to clean and then you're not going to have to throw this out because you're just going to be able to rinse it out. You could use the hose, you could shake it out, you could take it inside and rinse it out in the utility sink. It just will always continue to work. It's never going to get mold and dirty and worn out. It'll last and last and last. And there's our five pounds. Look wow. at that. It's all in there. You can barely see it. And we're going to show you a side-by-side -side comparison. And Where you do you see this? <laughs> Have you seen this before? No, I haven't. Oh, this is unbelievable. So we've sped up your life. So this could be six <laughs> months or a year of your mat. Look at the, the Cocoa Peat oh, mat oh on, the, on the right side of the screen. 
It's just getting overwhelmed by the amount of dirt. You'll start, it's look hilarious. at the threshold is covered in dirt and all the dirt's coming in the house. So the same amount of dirt, but look at how the AstroTurf mat is doing a better job at keeping it out of the house. I mean, you'll wow. see after a while that even it starts to show a little bit dirt, but you know what we're gonna do? The mat on the right, we're, what we're doing with that, that's going straight trash. to the trash. Circular but file. our mat, you can grab a hose, you can just spray it out, rinse out all that mud and dirt in there, and it's basically gonna be brand new again. I love yeah. it. And by the way, so we go over the colors for everyone, but you're not getting one, you're getting two, and I like that. So you have one for like, you know, the front door, or the back door, or maybe the side door. And the and the most important part about this really is that you're not tracking all of that sand and all that dirt right onto your beautiful, expensive hardwood floors or exactly. tile floors, right? Because I mean, you think we all have been in that situation and, and what it costs you to repair floors. Right, hardwood floor is always the one we think about. Mm -hmm. So if you know you have hardwood floors at any of those doors around your house, so you know, mine is outside our um, garage door. So inside the garage, but then it's a little yeah. step up into the kitchen and we have hardwood floors. So Perfect. It's, it's the spot to put it. But think about putting one at all those doors. So here's, I, I want you to see that again, those fingers, there's thousands of fingers that are going to do such a great job at grabbing the dirt off your shoes. But uh, there it is. Here's a super close up. You're seeing of those, all those little blades of grass, if you will, of the AstroTurf scraping the bottom of your shoes. It could be shoes and sneakers. It feels kind of neat, a little massage on bare feet. <laughs> Well, you'll like that on their feet. But then here's what happens to the dirt. Yeah. It falls down in between those blades of AstroTurf. So now the mat is still functioning. In that video we saw, you would have to start searching for an area to find a clean spot right. on the mat. But right. there's always a clean spot. And look at this. Look Prince. at the amount of mud coming out of this mat. So this could be this winter. You're gonna get a lot of mud. You're gonna get a lot of dirt. Mm -hmm. Rinse it out. The mat looks brand new. There's nothing to corrode. There's nothing to, you know, just exactly. start to break down. We've got a nice, you know, rubber back on mm -hmm. it. And again, those blades of AstroTurf are strong. We're going to let it's the like dirt fall down. It's like a filtration system oh, pretty almost, much, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> it does such a great job. They're a really nice size. And I'll show, actually, I'll show you the size comparison yeah. to that typical mat. I'll lay this back down and you'll be able to see. Because they're 36 by 20. Yeah, so when you see this, yeah, look at that. how much Dwarfs. more yeah. we're getting.